<laughs> so we, we wanted to come to you concerning the issue of marriage because um, we haven't discussed this in a while. It's been a while we talked about marriage and uh, women, um, says most women before their marriages, they, they look great for their men. You know, they do all the paparazzi, you do your nails, you look pretty, you know, you look really attractive. And after marriage, life happens, you know, you have the kids, um, you know, you are doing two jobs, you are doing so many things, you don't have time to keep up. And there's, there, there's a whole new community of, uh, what they call them, these, these side chicks, they are ready, there's a market, <laughs> they are, what, they are, there's a whole community of them waiting. And women are feeling threatened today, that what can I do to sustain that which I started before marriage? How do you advise women out there? To, to, to start this, um, to begin this process? Uh, first of all, every woman had the goal set in mind that I want to get married. Mm. And therefore, you need to attract as many in order to have that one that will set eyes upon you. So they go all out, they look the best, they keep the best. Mm. But once the marriage is done, the word is, I have settled. And once a woman says, I've settled, then what else are you doing after settlement? You have settled, which means you are now at home. So some women tend to lose guard because marriage throws upon you quickly responsibility and duty. Sound good. It is this duty, this responsibility that makes a woman because feel old. So marriage is for mature people. Yes. How do we get? Now, how do we raise our boys to get that maturity? This is the discussion we are having now. Yeah. Those who are listening, some are not aware. The first, he said, it is not the pregnancy that is the big deal. But when we read the Bible to people, say, God says, you shall have difficulty in childbirth. They think cesarean have come to cure that. No. The process of winning a child is a debilitating process. Mm -hmm. Women have now added more to this natural risk by adding unnatural responsibilities, <laughs> like chasing economic means. Have now added. Mm -hmm. In the process... Satan has also intervened to cripple the man so that the whole load becomes of the woman. And that woman now still needs to look young for a man that's looking for a and young one. Mm. You see, it's a matrix that we have. It's called, we've built a web of difficulty for the woman. So there were, there were these things where people were saying that women go old inside the house and they look young outside. Me, I know, I mean, I, mean, I, would, I would admit myself. <laughs> when I enter the house like this, I remove my wig. Because we go already all day. I'm already. I go straight to the bathroom, wash off the makeup. I want to be comfortable. I take off these tight fitted dresses that I have to wear for the show, and I look for one something comfortable, mm -hmm. and I wear it, and I and I and, I, and I'm okay. And and if I, I remove the undergarments, make to get to replace it with a more <laughs> comfortable one that doesn't have any wires around me, you know. So I think I can be free. Is that a crime? Mm. Um. No, it's not. But I think, you know, I, I, I am in a relationship. I'm not married in the conventional yeah, conventional way. In the conventional way. Go ahead, why? Don't listen to, don't listen to Jima. So <laughs> what, what I believe is, yes, you do need to make yourself feel comfortable. But I don't think it should be 24-7. I think... I mean, because, I, yes, I make myself feel comfortable, but I also want my partner to desire me. And I, when, um, even if I, for the first three, four hours, I've let myself go, I'm just lying like this. When I have my bath, I, I will just touch up small makeup, do my hair, That's wear acne, you know, mm. and then... Really? But why would you say that the uniqueness of your relationship affords you the luxury to be able to do because that. Because you don't have children you running around. You have no children running you around. You phase. haven't just picked up a child from school. She, she's taking, honeymooning, you know, right? She's honeymooning she's right now. Right. I'm she's telling just, you. She's just, she's just, she's just so having fun. We can't fun. Compare, <laughs> compare us to you. Yes. I, I agree. agree. No, yes. I agree. Yeah. And then the because marriage... right now, I'm looking after my two grandchildren. And you got that time, right? I don't have that time. Yeah. Right. That's exactly. So that's it. Exactly. The word marriage is like a crown of accomplishment as well. So they are not on the road to that. They are on the road of the fun part. So she's in the courtship for life. area. Mm -hmm. So she's able courtship to. Courtship for life. Courtship, for life. it's always. So for people like creating... us in our own category, mm -hmm. how do you help our ministry? Now, we how are you raising help... and nurturing. One of the things that men feel <laughs> devastated about, which they commonly say, is the fact that 
even those women that others praise that they look young hmm. outside. <laughs> if the husband describes what they see inside, inside. <laughs> according to the language, some women are not very care. They, they, they take for granted these things because they don't know that a man is excited by sight, especially men who work, who go to work in public offices. So men are not going to change. What men can only do now is to provide the best environment for the wife. Because today the woman is chasing one big project, economic means. As she's moving in her aging process, that's why I don't like them say age with the grace. Now they're not aging with what? Less grace. No. <laughs> the second part is that he should look at his wife and sit his wife down. Tell your wife to excite you a bit more. Men need it. It okay. makes us live well. If not really? for women, we would have, our life would have drained out of us. When we see you beautiful like that, some spark comes into human life. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's just say the wife doesn't excite you much. Yeah. But can the man put himself in a space where he gets excitement from women? Not do anything with them, just the fact that he's in their midst and then take the excitement home. Boom! It yes, does. that's what the Quran says. It says do. when you see a woman and you desire, the Quran says when you desire a woman, turn to your wife because what you desire in her is at home in your wife. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. Everything. So when I now turn to when they now turn, mm -hmm. what he see mm -hmm. is not as appealing <laughs> as what turned him to her. Mm. He gets heartbroken. Mm. He gets he gets into the woman. You know, a lot of well, men after the, now. after the after the first round, mm. they can no longer gain any erection because of. They, they only summon energy to have that erection. Ah, they do more than one. Well, they should do as many as possible. As they can.